Starting the year off right is hard. Making resolutions is one thing, sticking to them is another. Here's a look at how you can stay on track in 2009. Well, it's a new year and a new semester. That means it's time for resolutions. We talked with a counselor on addictive behaviors, Devon E. O. Pry, and got some advice on how to keep a resolution. Need some mental health counseling. I think for students and, and for college students especially, the trick is to find the one thing that will motivate them to keep them going throughout the year. McNeese offers many different programs and facilities that can help students stay active. The convenience of the rec center on campus can help students stick to their goals. When we asked some McNeese students what their resolutions were, staying in shape was at the top of their list. Yeah, but I really need to do a diet. Yeah. Thank you for pointing that out. <laughs> to be healthier this year, um, just for the sake of my well-being. Devaney discussed the problems that students may face while going to college. Financial concerns as a college student are one of the main concerns that students have. Um, also, uh, stress management is probably another concern that students have. How do they deal with um, financial issues that impede their ability to come to college, such as if they have to work full-time and be a full-time student. How do they get those um, hours in without feeling overwhelmed or without feeling um, as they have to kind of compensate by lack of sleep or otherwise. Endurance is probably another one because it's 12 months out of a year as opposed to just a week or two. Um, it, they tend to lose track of, of what the goals are and what the side is and so therefore if you don't have motivation in the endurance or, or the strength to do that then it can wane over time. With busy schedules it's hard to balance time for school and work along with time to eat healthy and stay in shape. But exercise can also lead to more energy and better performance. Yeah, it keeps me like energetic, you know, it keeps me feeling good about myself because after I work out, you know, like especially if I'm stressed out, I work out and yeah. it keeps, you know, it keeps me cool and everything. So basically I do it, I mean, for the enjoyment, but I still like to stay in shape too. So, Even though there are temptations, these guys aren't letting it get in their way. I, I, honestly, I really don't resist uh, fast food, you know, I <laughs> mean, anyway. even though this look like a uh, I do resist. No, I don't. Like, I gotta. I know I gotta stop because I know it's gonna catch up with me eventually. So, you know, I'm trying to trying to eat a little salad, you know, fruit, whatever. I'm trying to do it, but eventually I fall for the burgers. You know, they got like three of them around here. No, I ain't gonna have no trouble with it. Like I said, I've been doing it for a while. So if I stop doing it, I'm gonna feel weird because you know it's a part of my routine. We asked Devaney to discuss the steps that people can take in reaching their goals. Um, make sure you go to class and eat well and sleep well, um, all of the things that are healthy for your body so that you can have a clear mind and you can focus uh, whenever you're trying to carry out any resolution, whether it be New Year's or otherwise. And they actually offer, um, as you can see here, I don't know, um, they have a great workout gym. They got an upstairs um, aerobics area and all kind of stuff. Students agree the location is key. Oh man, it's convenient. I can walk. I mean, I live back there in Colette, so it's like real convenient. And like, since I got some spare time, you know, I come and try to make time for it. You know. If you or someone you know may need some extra guidance or motivation, the Counseling Center doors are always open. Um, come see us. Uh, definitely, we're here um, Monday through Friday, 8 to 4.30. If you guys are working on resolutions, if you feel like it's not even the February yet and you're having trouble. So if your resolution is getting into shape and eating healthier, then it looks like motivation along with commitment is the key to success. I'm Michelle Ammons, Inside McNeese.